There's always a great, you're absolutely right. Um, you know, I think this was a rare admission pretty quickly from Apple. Oh, we messed this up and we're going to try and fix it. We're going to do it best to try and fix it. Because there's so high expectations with Apple from the consumer side, any, any little thing, there's going to be like, oh, we don't trust Apple anymore. But guess what? They keep upgrading and buying these iPhones. Bottom line, though, what does this really mean? You still need to upgrade your phone. Even if you replace the battery, what the longer term narrative around Apple is they keep updating the OS. So a few generations behind, it, the, your hardware won't be able to handle it anymore. So you just have to sort of buy into this idea that you live in an Apple world and you're just sub subscribing to their service from here on out. And I think that's, you know, that's the, the end game here. And I think that's how they're really winning. If as a consumer you don't like that idea, you should just switch platforms because you're, you're stuck in it forever. You're going to always have to upgrade. Raul, you're a hardware guy. You, you bought the Essential phone a while back but had some problems with it. Where do you see Apple sitting kind of in the phone competition? How big a deal is this battery issue? I mean, Samsung had a much bigger battery issue a year plus ago. Yeah, I, I agree. Look, I think Apple is just becoming a nicer company. Look, this is not something they would have done under Steve Jobs. Um, you know, they're, they're basically admitting a mistake and they're fixing it and they're going above and beyond to fix it. I'm not an Apple guy. I've, I don't use an Apple phone. My kids do. I, I'm, uh, I'm an Android person. But, but I would say I think Apple is generally becoming more friendly. They're making acquisitions uh, in, in all sorts of spaces uh, that they never would have done before, such as AR, VR, things like that. And, uh, and this move to me just makes them into a, a nicer uh, Tim Cook company. Well, the other context is that yeah, there, there's a French consumer you know, group that's looking to sue Apple or suing Apple for, for this exact thing. So that's another you know, Among context. many groups Among that many are looking groups, to sue Right, them. exactly. So yeah, that, they, they could litigation. be reacting to that as much as anything else. Oh, yeah, yeah, trying to get ahead of it and forestall that a little yes. bit for sure. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.